Across the river, development in North Nashville has historically lagged behind. To help catch up that neighborhood, the mayor is setting aside two million infrastructure dollars and residents can choose how it's spent. News Channel 5's Hannah McDonald takes an in-depth look at the plan. 37208 is a chronically underinvested in community. Now we can't fix that all at once, but we can start. Mayor John Cooper is setting aside $2 million for North Nashville and Bordeaux to improve infrastructure and attitudes. Now Nashville is a city on the rise and every neighborhood must be part. Work with the community, make it priority, uh, especially uh, where we know there's a lot of mistrust as well. Eric Brown in the mayor's office is a resident of the neighborhood. I'm very passionate about it. He's telling his neighbors about the money earmarked for improvements. And so I think this is a perfect time uh, to really deal with the community, the history of how policy has in some ways been unused. And we really want to make sure that we're right in the wrong. Well. National needs a long-term economic development strategy. Building the proposed transit center on Clarksville Pike may elevate the community, but letting residents pick the next project may excite them. They've been very supportive of hearing of the projects, but, you know, of course, there's always going to be a little bit of concern of will this be for the black community that is here right now. The mayor says to continue to be a city on the rise, every community needs to be part of the ascent. Working with HBCUs, he says, will bring North Nashville more into the fold. So I don't think we can really talk about a lot of the work without really dealing with those anchor institutions and making sure that we're, we're not only partnering with them, but also understanding the impact that they do for community. This is the first time a neighborhood will decide how to spend a part of Metro's budget, and it may not be the last. It's recognizing an underserved community. There's more than just one in Nashville and trying to address the problem. In North Nashville, Hannah McDonald, News Channel 5. Thanks, Hannah. In fact, neighborhood listening sessions will begin at the end of the summer and folks as young as 14 can attend and you don't need to be a registered voter.